Hey guys, how you doing? Bringer here. Today I got a big money replay for you in the Belfast. It's a pretty exciting gameplay. Stick around to the end because it's pretty action packed all the way through. So we're just gonna speed through the beginning here like normal. Playing with my buddy Chuck in a division. He's in a destroyer. So I'm gonna push up over here towards C with him, help give him cover. Both of our other destroyers were uh, deciding to sail this way too, so I asked one of them to go to B. We're going to stop here and start taking shots at the Helena. Smoke generator activated. Pop our smoke so we're safe. I'm liking what I see currently right here. We got a couple battleships sailing in. And that's just that's money coming at me, I see. So a couple tips for you guys if you want to make money. When you have all these different ships like this sailing at you. Try to hit them all. Get some damage on all of them. Get your Confederate flag. Or uh pin. And um, that'll give you a boost in EXP and credits earned. So we're going for the fire here on Nelson. We get one. We're going to switch to the Colorado. Destroyer pops up. We're going to switch to him. Start putting some heat down on him. My buddy Chuck, I believe, is engaged with them too. Slap. Get him out of here. Enemy sunk. Start looking for shots out here again. Slinging at the Colorado. Nelson said, forget this. He's out. Or so I thought. Just keeping heat on all of them. I still got a little bit of time left on my smoke here. A destroyer actually rolled through here and popped one, so I'm in a fresh one currently. Fresh smoke. Which I approve of big time. So we're three and a half minutes in. I'm up to 44,000 damage. One kill. It's like five or six fires already. Six. <clears throat> And I've hit every ship over here that I could hit. I've hit the Nelson, the Colorado, the Helena, or Helena, however you want to say it, and I killed that destroyer. For more than half his life, so that'll I'll get some good credits and EXP from that. And then right here to Nelson, I forgot about him. He did not forget about me. Right here, uh, we're gonna get slapped. You get a good look right there. Some shells overpenning the superstructure. We also take a citadel. And then directly after that, we get slammed again. This is my fault for not respecting that Nelson a little more to push through like he did. So, I know uh, we're just going to keep putting heat over here in this Colorado. The smoke clouds deployed there, so I knew I was safe to shoot. He goes out of range. We're going to speed it up a little bit here for my U-turn. So, I'm playing a little more cautious now because I only got about a third of my life left. Pop my smoke cloud, he's to Nelson, I figure he's just going to Rambo out now after what he just did. He's on a mission. So, I start slinging some heat over the mountain at him to hopefully make him change his mind about coming around the corner. I got a battleship a little further west of me, but about the same angle, so maybe the Nelson won't be dumb and push completely out. I see he fires there. At the friendly battleship that's pretty far um, 
southwest of me, which is currently being harassed by a destroyer. So I'm trying to help him out, shoot at the destroyer a little bit. It's just going to be a real hard hit at this range. My buddy Chuck and it looks like the other two destroyers on our team have like a little destroyer fleet going on there sailing through the islands. And they got torpedo soup out in the water. This poor Colorado. Get an up close look at this. He gets him right up the butt here. One, two. He's gonna get slapped. Slap. So we're going for the kill here. I don't like letting battleships get away. I want to at least get a fire on them. Because you know he just put a flood out. Can't let them get away and regen back up. There's really nobody else in that area that could do something to them. Whiff there. Yeah, if you guys want to make money, man, my, my best ship has been the Belfast. Just consistent credits. You can support the flags early on like I did there. Get the destroyers taken out. And that's going to that's gonna give you good credits right there. Defender uh, medals on the flags. Those really boost your uh, income. Those little green flags you get. Ribbons. Nelson's in full retreat. I'm in full set your ass on fire mode. Destroyer pops up. Switch to him real quick. Kind of whiff there. Right, he's playing the skinny game here. And I'm playing the slap you anyway game. It's so right here. I do two shots, three, make him turn, and then I put one more further out for his turn. We'll get his engine. He's trying to pop his smoke. It's not going to help him much. His fate sealed. Slap. So, that's two of the three enemy destroyers I've killed. We're up to 102,000 damage. And rising with the Nelson fire cooking. We're spotted, so now we get up, get up to speed, start maneuvering. Get the Nelson kill. Those I'm like, okay, that's the destroyer that just killed me. I got my buddy Chuck here in the destroyer to my north. Help and keep vision for me. So I know if everybody else dies, I can keep him on my side to at least spot stuff for me so I can shoot at the stuff. We're communicating this whole game back and forth with each other. Third destroyer pops up. Danger close. Right here, I, I was a little uh, shook. It's like, oh boy, Torps. Won't lie, right here, I thought I was dead. Big time. I was like, you were going down with me. Dodge that set like a boss. Kill his... Kill him and, um... I got a Helena here. Now, I make a mistake. I should have pushed into this, um, smoke cloud that he just popped. But I was so focused with talking to my buddy and trying to coordinate our attacks that I kind of missed it there a little bit. I'm still utilizing it, but I want to keep pushing up. I don't want to just sit there, so I pop mine just to be safe. So I can't afford taking hits. I thought he was going to eat those torps from my angle. He doesn't. So we're up to four kills. Killed all three enemy destroyers this game. Quite a few uh, medals. 125,000 damage. 
making money. We got a fire cooking on him. He disappears. Pop the radar, shoot at him. I switched to AP, but it's a little too late for the AP. He gets around the corner on me. That would have been my Kraken right there. Now right here I make a mistake. You see how long I've been just aiming at this guy, thinking about, you know, what he's doing. I should have switched over here to this Mutsu. That was in range. I could have had like two, three salvos out on him already. But we move out, get this little piece of island here between me and him. And we commence on trying to set him on fire. It's making that money. Fire on the first hit. Get a witherer. Another fire. I asked my buddy there if he was spotted. He's safe, so he's the one keeping Mutsu spotted for me. Mutsu is full on cooking over there. No sushi on that thing. Everything is cooked. He puts the fires out, so I'm like, alright, perma burn time. I switched to AP there. I'm not sure where I, I thought he was going to turn broadside all the way, but I think he turns back in because of these torps. Right, this guy does the right thing. He dodges those torps. He knows where I'm at. So he starts coming at me, closing the gap. Now I shoot here, big mistake, I didn't notice the plane up. He spots me. I get slapped a little bit there, get lucky that I don't die. We get a double fire on him. Airplanes, looked like the airplane just landed, it wasn't up that long. Or it had been up and I just didn't notice. Stuff like that you gotta pay attention for. Airplanes. <laughs> All of it. But in battles like this, sometimes you just miss stuff. Nobody's perfect. So we're at four kills. Damage is going up. If we can kill this Mutsu, that'll be our Kraken. You know we want the Kraken. Do some absolute horrible shooting right now. I should have aimed those a little higher. Probably could have hit them. It's alright. I, I shouldn't have gotten this close to this island either. I should have been, you know, kiting him around the island, but farther away from it myself. So I could have lobbed over this at him. But I'm so close with the, the shell velocity of these shells, they just fly straight and I can't lob them over. So we're, uh, we're actually going to lose this game. 181,000 damage, 4 kills. We're going to lose it to score. Thanks for watching the video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Um... I, it was a good game for me. I enjoyed playing it. So we get 1,180,000 credits. 2,500 base EXP out. EXP in the uh, enemies. Alright guys, subscribe. Peace.